Good morning everybody. I'm trying to figure out if this angle of my camera will be enough for me to do some parade. Alright, I think it could be enough. Okay, so I might well have to time from time sip on coffee. So I have to stop. Um, we have in here the video that I promised for you for <laughs> quite some time now and I think it's the time so we have a tiger parade video today I have in here some finishes I have brand new canvases and diamond painting I have a whip that we are working on currently and I have a cross stitches in here which not too many uh, I want to have well I have one more fame of shame so I will show you what that is I think we will start we will start we will start from this one so I will push a little bit to the side of my cross stitch maybe somewhere on a chair in here behind me and I will show you what this is I even forgot about this I know that Catherine was working on it. I started that Catherine continue and we still did not do it. This is tigers. I think it's like Siberian tigers. Somebody comment on my video that tiger, you know, the, I will show you later that canvas. The tigers live only where it's hot, not um, where it's ice. And I was just thinking, okay, I have many canvases that tigers in the ice. This is actually like a North Pole, something like Siberia, I don't know. And that is a cold up there, and that is a white tiger, I believe. And then I came to my mind that, do you watch ever movie Ice Age? I think everybody does, especially if you have a kids. It's one of my favorite movies. Ice Age and there is a Siberian or whatever the tiger up there that obviously they live in Ice Age so not every tiger I guess live in tropical so let's just uh, if I'm wrong I'm wrong but I think I might be right in here so this is paint by number it has so many little we kind of did some sky and little bit stripes on a little baby of the tiger but there's lots to go and I think the colors a little bit not exactly like in a picture if I find a picture I will put the screenshot uh, for the picture so you can see actually what this is but I'm sure even looking in here you probably would recognize what kind of picture that is if you're a diamond painting, you probably came across this painting many, many times. So this is obviously paint by numbers and lots of spots in here are very, very, very tiny. Uh, so I have a whole bunch of new brushes that I can actually use them. And maybe this year of Tiger, I will be able to finish this. So I checked not long ago my paint. It looks like it's still good. It did not dry out. So I will have to continue with this one. I think that paint by number is not really my favorite thing to do. But sometimes, you know, it's okay to have, right? So now I will show you, well, let me just uh, put this one so we can kind of get away. So this tiger is from GBFKE and if you follow my latest video, they did, by my request, brought this tiger back into the store and if you wish to order, follow the link and it's absolutely gorgeous, 45 by 85, beautiful size, beautiful gems. So whatever they will have in the store, uh, they told me they will send me this tiger together with my package. So hopefully this tiger will be same quality as this one, the one that they uh, brought back to the store, exactly the same one. 
but also there is a tiger up there with like a brown or fiery something background very similar but a little bit different love this one so this is the king of the year okay the one that in my lips so far and it's not going to be just the one in my lips now i will show you some finishes that i have this one i finished a year or two years ago i can't even remember but this one is the rhinestones that is always the sparkle gems hopefully we can see very well all the gems they are super gorgeous and sparkle and this one because i was doing a long time ago i did not write down name i used to didn't write down name of where i got this from but if you are patient enough i order i hope i'm right this the same look same canvas but big so watch out for the video i don't know when this package will arrive looks like the packaging and all those restrictions now a little bit lifted in china so the package is coming faster now um so yeah uh, just wait till i show you and i think that one the big one i say also will be these gems well i hope i'm right now there is one more i have finished i only have a two finishes of tigers and this one is a multi-panel that i finished a long time ago long time ago and i wasn't really impressed with this canvas the colors in here are beautiful they look kind of nice from the far but i think the tiger here which is right here i think the tiger in here is the best looking but the babies if you can see like very for example um this this is the mama lion this is like all different uh mothers with babies and like it's blending and baby to the mother and especially this one also in here but also i saw this canvas is all in a separate panel so you don't have to buy multi-panel you can just pick what you like i really like the background in here and diamonds in here beautiful uh, but as I say, you know, if I was looking on a thumbnail and here in a picture, that's exactly how it looks like even on a website, kind of um, very light color that babies blend in into the mother. So it's like barely you can recognize what that is. Like, um, I say it's a little bit pixelated for me. Like mothers looks good, but babies is really kind of pixelated. Um, nice diamonds very shiny as well and lo I love that colors in here on the background so this is the square diamonds in here so that's the only two finishes that I have so far and for this two finishes I dig out through my diamond paintings what a mess I made up there so now I have to <laughs> go on like for half an hour to clean up but at the same time i just wanted to reorganize my diamonds um the one that's already finished i will do the same thing as i did my brand new diamond paintings and organize them by this clear envelope to kind of put them into the um, categories so when i go and pick something from my comparison video it will be much easier for me to find so now next one this one is also from gpfke it looks like i have lots of canvases in here from them and happen to be tigers so this is the, like a gorgeous tiger with this beautiful colors neon colors in a black this almost like a glow and i did wolf in this colors and looks so beautiful uh, lots of light hard to see because this is a dark canvas but it will be gorgeous how much clothes i can show you that's kind of far for me to reach uh some of the product that maybe like a smaller later on i can show you maybe close shot we'll see but i think you will get idea what we have in here 
Uh, next one, little one, this one actually um, 30 by 40 centimeters from GBFKE if you interested now some of them I ordered a long time ago so I have no idea if it's still available okay this one 30 by 40 from uh, what is this from crafty art this is very pretty tiger it looks like created from like a real picture because look because looks really realistic so maybe this diamond painting was created from the photo Okay, very very nice and colorful, like r very realistic. Now, <clears throat> I was thinking, and this is, is from Fancel, I thought this is Tiger, and then uh, some of my viewers, now when I look at it, like, yes, I was wrong, this is definitely not Tiger. <laughs> Looks like um, snow bars or bobcat, how you call it, snow, snow, snow cat, something that is uh, not tiger. But it's so gorgeous that I wanted to start on it. And this canvas is big, 50 by 60 centimeters. And diamonds already pre-packed it to Ziploc bags, gorgeous, gorgeous cat. And I wanted to start on it so badly. But because it's not tiger, I might well start, but it's not going to be like my thing to do immediately, which I really, really want to. I might well be starting on this one because it's chasing me. I really like, I cannot stop thinking about it. This eyes, those icicles, it's so gorgeous. It is stunning, 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 stunning look, love this masterminding those eyes it's just like a hypnotize you so this is amazing amazing and i love the size 50 by 60 not only this element in this diamond painting big it will create such a good oh, this this picture will be perfect because it's very very good shot of it of the like items i can say items uh, the tigers, not tigers, cat, whatever, cat face. It's so big that you will see all the details what's in here is going on. Uh, I even thinking maybe in some of those popsicles, uh, not popsicles, icicles, maybe to even to add some kind of like a clear gems to sparkle them up. I think that would be beautiful as well. So yes, not tiger, but I was thinking that this is tiger for a long, long time. All right. <clears throat> Thank you to my viewer to correct me. Uh, let me just sip a little bit of coffee because today I'm losing my voice. <clears throat> Next one, and here is the proof that tigers not only live in a tropical, he's obviously sitting in the snow. <clears throat> so tigers can live in the snow because this is a winter tiger. Definitely live in the snow and when you think right now a zoo right we, in Canada we have lots of zoos and yes they live in a zoo and they go outside for a walk so obviously they adapted to be in a tropical or in the winter and they love to roll in the snow and play with the Christmas can't you ever like did you ever see a video on YouTube how they bring to wildcats Christmas presents and they try to unwrap and play in with those boxes uh, in the closure where they are. So this one is from Fancel also. It looks like and this is the one that we recently with you unbox two of them together in one video. So one is a summer tiger and one is winter tiger. Both of them from Fancel. Both of them 40 by 60 centimeters and they are both gorgeous. So let me show you each of them more in this angle. Okay. And then Summer Tiger also. It looks like they this one also created from the picture and feels to me like it's very similar. Is it the same type? Um, no, a little bit, little bit different look. <clears throat> yes, 
yeah also gorgeous tiger mm. beautiful the stripes on the face oh you just want to scratch behind his ears isn't it and listen to his purr and then this tiger that we have for a long uh, well i believe it's a tiger look at this and some of yes definitely it's a tiger uh one of my viewers says that she's already <coughs> excuse me please somebody already completed this one and i was attempt to start last year and never went to because i have so much other things to do but uh, as i mentioned in my unboxing video when i did there is a huge amount of confetti in this area on his face if i can bring them more close to you you can see how many changes of colors up there as far as i can get it but the way it's going to look so realistic i love this look that is just like a one eye peeking through the grass and he's looking for his prey <laughs> Wow, this is gorgeous. This canvas is 45 by 85 centimeters, same size as we're working right now on a tiger. Uh, this one I did not write down, but I think that was my like a uh, first canvases that I ordered from. Uh, more likely, this is from Fanso because before when I didn't have too many companies on my channel, I pretty much uh, remember where my canvas is from. And I did not write down name. That was like a fan cell. So hope this I think this is from fan cell. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And yeah, like this way would be nice to show you a whole thing in one shot. But I think it's pretty much fit in my shot like this. Gorgeous tiger. And now for the big finale of diamond paintings. I have this canvas which is, look how big that is, this one is from GBFKE and this canvas was laying on the bottom of my canvases under my table where I show you in my collection and up there uh, like I have a, like a double table in my craft room and a bottom table all the bigger canvases size like this and this is size let me tell you 50 by 110 from gbfke and this tiger was there that i even forgot i have it was laying under my table and omg it's gorgeous uh we'll have to try to show you somehow we saw the flare here is the cubs laying on the bottom in the grass very long canvas and then parent not sure mother or father and look at this beautiful sunset it just keep going and going this is definitely a picture like maybe in africa where is this gorgeous red sunset with those big massive trees up there in the back i don't even know how to show you this properly because it is big it's me and 10 centimeters long so this is uh, like must have if you can buy this one now I did not check store if they still have this canvas or not, or not. Uh, I will check for you so if you will find this link under my video then go ahead and purchase I will try to link it up for you as much as I can find on a website that is go with the name that I've received them okay uh, if something that I don't find a link it's mean it's not going to be linked or maybe I will ask companies like if you see something and I don't have a link it's mean it's sold out or it's not in store anymore but if you would love to purchase I can ask company to bring it back to the store as uh, GBFKE kindly brought the other tiger back to store. So this is just amazing, this canvas. And now for those who like cross stitch, I have in here, let's see how many tigers I have in here. Uh, one, oh, there's one in here. 
and the wild cat. I don't know. I have in here that not exactly tiger, and there's one more in here. Well, since I brought them, I might as well just show you because I have accidentally pulled out lions, and I have two lions. Or well, I guess I pull out mostly of the wild cat, but it's not exactly tiger. Uh -huh. I don't know why I did that. Okay, never mind. So we will we will see. So this one, tiger, tiger, tiger. And so this is three, not tiger. I don't know why I brought them in here. I guess my plan originally was to bring you to like the whole like a wild cats. And then I decided to change my mind and I started to go only with the cross stitches. So you know what this one, I'm just gonna come to you close to the camera and show you just the picture so it's so you can see uh, what's in here. This is obviously this is cheetah. Love this one. This one from DIY Choose. Lovely. Um, lion from let me DIY. That's a beautiful family. And then this lions also from Everyday E Crafts. Okay, so this is the not exactly tigers. No idea why I have them here. Uh, but I do. Let me just put them right under the camera. And now we are going to to see some tigers. Now, this is the tiger number one, and I know that Julie already stitching this one. She got the good chunk part in here of the nose, like a bottom corner, that's where she started. That's what I would start in here as well. So I think this is, you know, let me, let me open just to pull out the canvas itself. Uh, this one tiger from Biggest Craft and it's 44 by 35 centimeters in 14 count. So I think this is like a small canvas, look at this, with the big patches of colors, no confetti whatsoever. So I think I will start this one as well so I have something in cross stitch and tiger because I don't have, I was thinking if I have any of my whips of tiger and I don't. So I will be creating this one. So I will start and keep up with you ladies. Uh, I think Julie and somebody else working on this tiger, please uh, let me know in my pinned comment who else working on this tiger or just a comment in under video. Uh, yeah, so this is like the smallest one. Now I have a beautiful tiger. This one is 44 by 64 centimeters. This is really like a whole bunch of different stuff. Um, girls' hair looks like a waterfall. But look at this up there on the bottom of the staircase. We have a tiger. So that's also with the tiger. And this one, yeah, 44 by 64 centimeters, 14 count, and from FGOBY. Next one, uh, they kind of like similar, like this one. We we'll have to restart my video. We are already in 23 minutes. Uh, so this one too, one I got in Romantic Stories. Some of you ask me, how do I know where is Romantic Story? How have, have to find them? Well. Obviously, I don't know because they don't place in description what company exactly. So far, I asked company to identify Joy Sunday, so at least you have good canvases as uh, Joy Sunday instead of those uh, no brand that is pixelated and horrible uh, that China decided to print. I wish they don't, but they do, and lots of you get disappointed after you receive them. But I, I love romantic story and here is the picture. They are also sitting in the winter. You can see there is frosty branches up there. Nice. Very nice picture of this one. 
and the size in here will be so this one um, is a 14 no this is 11 count this one in 11 count so in 11 count it will be 68 by 49 centimeters and then we have this one in 14 count this one is 56 by 41 and it's from DP Clubs. Did I say her from my romantic story from? Oh, romantic story. It's from Everyday E Crafts. Everyday E Crafts. And this one is from DP Clubs. This one is underwater swimming. Gorgeous picture. I love this picture a lot. Mm -hmm. and then we have two more left and I would love to show you this one more than just like this because this is look at the size of this canvas look at the size of this canvases so I have both of them in 14 count uh, both of them very similar kind of uh, they are in the snow and they this one just a couple but this one have a babies in here so this size okay this one a little bit smaller 134 by 56 can you imagine meter 34 and this is in 14 count can you imagine how big this will be when you order in 11 count that would be humongous over two meter long and this one is 163 by 89 this is almost two meters like oh my god this is humongous and it's also in 14 count so just to show you how amazing this canvas is how big that is i would love to open for you because this tigers is just like oh my god you should have it you should have it and let me show you first of all i would love to show you a picture but close to camera you can see they have a baby up there what is it, like a three cups I think let me check uh, one two three four four yeah there is a four baby up there there nice and I saw somebody was stitching this one and it looks fantastic and the one the other one bigger one i already saw the finished result and that's why i wanted to have it because it's so beautiful and have it in here big pack of extra nicely packed extra threads in here and then let me show you how amazing that is and the colors in here colors in here but it's not what I, you can see my unboxing video as well but now i just wanted to show you the massive size of this canvas and how beautiful it's printed so all this partial in here white you don't have to stitch but look how big that is Look how big that is. And this one is shorter and 30 centimeters than the other canvas. Beautiful. Look at us. I think you should have in your collection because <laughs> of the year of tiger. Of course, if you like wild cats, this is fantastic though. And then the other one, even bigger, just like it's so it's like you keeping it i don't know the treasure in your hands did i mention um where this from Col colorful diy the other tiger and this one from everyday e crafts and look at this look at this stuff so this is in last in our collection for today huge book tons of pages in here look at that uh, how many colors in here let me remind myself probably not too many because it's a 
40 pages in here this picture and we have full stitch in 43 colors and also there's a seven colors in back stitch in here but here's the show you the picture more close I saw this canvas stitched already and I think it was two meter long a little bit bigger even canvas it looks so gorgeous and lady were stitching I think for two years so that was kind of I would say pretty fast that she stitched this kind of big canvas in two years oh my goodness look at that look at look at this look how satisfying that is look at that so pretty look so many palettes this one threads only because they write down numbers and they leak to the threads so I don't know if that's going to be washable or not hopefully it is but that's a big chunk of goodness love these threads and then let open up and see all this green color you need to stitch and that is 3865 which is kind of like white color so I don't even know well it's probably off white color because also white in here on the top and look at that this one is really uh, big even this way not only long oh my goodness and this is 14 count Wow, oh, this is huge. This is humongous. Look at that. This is like a blanket, like a tapestry. When you finish this, it will look amazing. So this is humongous. Humongous. If I would hold it to myself vertical, um, so this one, it's almost... Um, I would say, what was it, one, it's my height, almost my height, because I remember my height was 164, I believe, and this can was 163, so it's like almost me, I can lay down on it, it's going to be the, the, the way I told, this is the canvas link, isn't that amazing? This is going to be stitched like, whoa, you know, all the same color. Mm -hmm. I don't know if this should be like uh, more colors in here. Let me check one more time picture. But my goodness, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous canvas. Lots of the same color though uh, up there. Let me see how they look like on a picture. Okay, I see. It. Yeah, that's exactly on a picture to... It's like a snow, it's white. But what I'm thinking, you can even skip not to stitch there. And when you wash, it's going to be white snow anyway. And that is, um, if I look in here on a palette, right? 65, they are white, okay? This is the colors. So I don't see really why you need to stitch that unless you don't want to see the... Um, fabric itself then you would stitch to fill in all those free spaces I would even put some kind of like a sprinkles of that silver thread that we uh, lately review with you or silver or this pearlescent to kind of sparkle up a little bit something mm, okay so this is it my friends here is my collection of all the tigers that I have. That is all my tigers. What do you think about this? How can I even put them back now? It's amazing. No, it wasn't like this. Okay. Don't know how to put this back. I don't know how to put this back. It doesn't fit now. How it was it? <laughs> I don't know how this was. Well, I guess somehow like that. Like this. Like this. Okay, and then I'm going to put in the book. 
Wow, what do you think about this collection? And how many of these tigers do you own in your collection? Do we have any canvases that together, like you and I? So we have the same. So yes, this is a wonderful collection. I really like it. And I hope you enjoy with this video. Now I'm going to put them away and keep reorganizing my room because to pull out all these canvases I need to create more mass first, right? Because I have to pull them out now because my canvases were separated already. My All my craft stitch was separated by the category in the boxes like animals, animals the birds and flowers and everything is in a different, you know, category. Now I have to put back them into the boxes. So the, this tiger is my like one of those favorites. I just love, I love this one. I love this one a lot. And of course, oh, let me know what should I do? What should I do? Should I work on this one? Or should I start which one? Uh, besides the other one that we work in, should I work on something else or not? Uh, comment below please and let me know what you think. But I will be starting on the smallest canvas. So hopefully we can finish fast and enjoy this tiger this year. This one little one of cross stitch because I don't have any tiger in cross stitch. And so I would love to have one. All right, my friends, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this little parade. And I will see you next time.